everyone welcome to weekly current affair quiz let's start today's quiz first question is what percentage of pilots in india are women as highlighted by pm modi 5% 10% 15% or 20% the correct answer is option c 15% the second asia pacific ministerial conference on civil aviation concluded with the adoption of the delhi declaration the conference took place from september 11 to 12 2024 at bharat mandapam in new delhi pm modi highlighted india's advancements in aviation especially noting that 15% of pilots in india are women significantly higher than the global average of 5%. Next question, which organization is partnering with Indian Immunologicals for the development of the Zika vaccine? WHO, Griffith University, Oxford University or Pfizer? The correct answer is option B, Griffith University. Indian Immunologicals and Indian Council of Medical Research signed an MOA for the development of India's first Zika vaccine. The vaccine will be a codon D optimized life attenuated type. The vaccine will be developed in partnership with Griffith University Australia. It will be a life attenuated vaccine which will be codon D optimized to weaken the virus. Next question who is hosting the Quad Leaders Summit on 21st of September 2024 India Australia United States or Japan the correct answer is option C United States the US will host the Quad Leaders Summit on 21st September 2024 US President Joe Biden will host the summit in Wilmington Delaware this will be the fourth in person meeting of the Quad consisting of India Australia Japan and the US Next question under which article of the Indian constitution is Hindi in the Devanagari script recognized as the official language of the union article 120 article 343 article 356 or article 370 the correct answer is option B article 343 India adopted Hindi written in Devanagari script as the official language of the Republic of India on 14th September 1949 Hindi was adopted as the official language under the article 343 of the Indian Constitution. Next question which of the following individuals has not received the Bharat Ratna award? C Rajgopalachari, Sarvapalli Radhakrishnan, M Vishweshwaraya or Kishore Kumar? The correct answer is option D Kishore Kumar. National Engineers Day in India is celebrated every year on 15th September to commemorate the birth anniversary of Sir Moksha Gundam Vishweshwaraya. a renowned indian engineer and a statesman the day is dedicated to celebrating the extraordinary contributions of engineers to society recognizing their spirit of innovation and highlighting the crucial role they play in influencing the world next question which international treaty was established to phase out the production of ozone depleting substances kyoto protocol paris agreement montreal protocol or geneva convention the correct answer is option c montreal protocol world ozone day also known as the international ozone day for the preservation of the ozone layer is celebrated every year on 16th september in 1994 the united nations general assembly proclaimed 16th september the international day for the preservation of the ozone layer next question what is the new name of port player shri vijayapuram rajapur andaman nagar or freedom city the correct answer is option a shri vijayapuram the central government has officially renamed port player to shri vijayapuram as part of an initiative to remove colonial imprints from place names in india Port Blair the capital of the Andaman and Nicobar Islands was originally named after Captain Archibald Blair a British colonial navy officer Next question how much reduction in new growth has been observed in Asian tropical forest due to ozone pollution 5.1% 8.5% 10.9% or 7.2% The correct answer is option C 10.9% A new study reveals that ground level ozone is hampering the growth of tropical forest. The study was published in Nature Geoscience and highlights how ozone pollution impacts the carbon absorbing capacity of forest. The research estimates that 290 million tons of carbon dioxide remain uncaptured annually due to this issue. Next question which countries are receiving aid under India's operation Sadbhav? Myanmar, Laos, Vietnam, Thailand, Cambodia, Vietnam. Laos, Thailand, Philippines or Bangladesh, Myanmar, Vietnam. 
द करेक्ट आंसर इज ऑप्शन ए म्यांमार लाओस वियतनाम इंडिया लॉन्च ऑपरेशन सद्भाव टू प्रोवाइड एमरजेंसी रिलीफ टू म्यांमार लाओस एंड वियतनाम द रिलीफ एफर्ट रिस्पॉन्ड्स टू द सीवियर फ्लडिंग कॉज बाय टाइफून यागी विच हैज डिवास्टेटेड दीज कंट्रीज ओवर टू हंड्रेड लाइव वर लॉस्ट एंड थाउजेंड्स वर डिसप्लेसड ड्यू टू द टाइफून्स इम्पैक्ट नेक्स्ट क्वेश्चन वॉट वॉज आइडेंटिफाइड एज अ की फैक्टर इन द ग्रेट डाइंग एक्सटिंक्शन इवेंट एस्टीरॉयड मेगा एल नीनो अर्थ क्वेक और आइस एज द करेक्ट आंसर इज ऑप्शन बी मेगा एल नीनो अ न्यू रिसर्च पब्लिश इन साइंस शेड्स लाइट ऑन द कॉज ऑफ द ग्रेट डाइंग एक्सटिंक्शन इवेंट टू फिफ्टी टू मिलियन ईयर्स अगो साइंटिस्ट हैव आइडेंटिफाइड अ मेगा एल नीनो इवेंट मच स्ट्रॉगर एंड प्रोलॉन्ग्ड दैन दोज ऑब्जर्व टूडे एज अ की फैक्टर इन दिस मास एक्सटिंक्शन The study reveals that extreme climate shifts during this period caused over 90% of life on Earth to vanish. Next question: What is the approximate size of asteroid 2024 PT5? 5 meters, 10 meters, 15 meters, or 20 meters? The correct answer is option B, 10 meters. Earth is about to gain a temporary mini moon in the form of asteroid 2024 PT5. This asteroid was discovered on August 7, 2024 and will be captured by Earth's gravity from September 29 to November 25, 2024. During this period, asteroid 2024 PT5 will orbit around Earth, but it will not complete a full orbit. Next question, what caused the food shortages in southern Africa? Conflict, El Nino, economic collapse or flooding? The correct answer is option B, El Nino. Zimbabwe announced plans to cull 200 elephants to combat food shortages caused by an extreme drought. This follows the worst drought in 40 years triggered by the El Nino weather phenomenon. Approximately 68 million people across southern Africa are suffering from hunger due to crop failures. Next question, who has Hezbollah blamed for the pager explosions? USA, Israel, Russia or Syria? The correct answer is option B, Israel. A deadly attack occurred in Lebanon and Syria where explosive devices hidden in pagers used by Hezbollah members detonated. Hezbollah blamed Israel for the attack though no official statement has been made by the Israeli military. Next question, by what year is the ozone layer expected to recover over the Antarctic? 2040, 2045, 2066 or 2050. The correct answer is option C, 2066. The ozone layer is on track to recover despite a major volcanic eruption near Tonga in 2022. The eruption caused short-term ozone depletion due to increased atmospheric water vapor. The World Meteorological Organization confirmed the overall impact on the ozone was limited. Next question who chaired the committee to explore the feasibility of the one nation one election proposal Narendra Modi Ramnath Kovind Amit Shah or Arvind Kejriwal the correct answer is option B Ramnath Kovind the union cabinet has approved the one nation one election proposal it aims to hold simultaneous elections for the lok sabha state assemblies and local bodies the plan has been a key promise of the nda government since it came to power in 2014 Next question what is the primary purpose of neuralink's blind sight device restore hearing restore vision enhance memory or cure paralysis the correct answer is option b restore vision elon musk company neuralink has received approval from the us food and drug administration for its blind sight device the blind sight device aims to restore vision in people who have lost both eyes or are blind from birth Next question where will COP29 be held in 2024 New Delhi Baku Copenhagen or Paris the correct answer is option B Baku Azerbaijan will be hosting COP29 from 11th to 22nd November 2024 in Baku the event will focus on finalizing a climate finance agreement for the post 2025 period Azerbaijan announced the launch of a new climate finance action fund Next question who developed the world's first solar tile Elon Musk, Shani Pandya, Ratan Tata or Sundar Pichai. The correct answer is option B, Shani Pandya. A local startup developed the world's first solar tile made from plastic waste. The solar tile was presented to Prime Minister Narendra Modi at the Renewable Energy Investor Meet in Gujarat. This innovation addresses two major issues: plastic pollution and the need for renewable energy. Next question what is the payload capacity of the NGLV to low earth orbit 10 tons 30 tons 4 tons or 15 tons the correct answer is option B 30 tons
the union cabinet led by pm modi approved the development of the next generation launch vehicle this development is a key step towards india's ambitious space goals including a manned lunar landing by 2040 and the establishment of the bharatiya antariksh station last question when was the indus waters treaty signed 1950 1960 1970 or 1980 the correct answer is option b 1960 india has issued a formal notice to pakistan seeking a review and modification of the indus water treaty this is the second notice in two years signaling india's intent to renegotiate the 1960 agreement india cites fundamental and unforeseen changes in circumstances as the reason behind the need for modification So that's all for today do share your scores and reviews about the program thanks for watching For more informative content like share and subscribe and do not forget to press the bell icon to get the notifications